Now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. Okay, there's a live look outside right now from the Sheraton and Jeff looking back off to the south towards downtown Louisville, of course, the Second Street Bridge. Notice those overcast skies. The clouds continue to thicken up after a decent amount of sunshine the first half of the day, and those temperatures responded. It was a nice afternoon. We went all the way up to 59 for that afternoon high, which is just about where it should be for the time of year. Cold this morning, down at 33. Right now it is cloudy, 57 degrees. The humidity very low, 23%. And here's the deal, because the atmosphere is so dry, with rain moving in, it's going to cool off quickly. Once the rain sets in, the 50s will quickly go down into the 40s. So any outdoor plans, even mid towards late evening, expect much chillier air to build in with that rain. A south wind at 14 miles per hour. Here is the radar scan. Still nothing around the metro or surrounding regions, but you can see the speckles of green just off to the west. And yeah, we do have some light rain falling across southwestern portions of Indiana, close to Owensboro, out through Evansville, down to Paducah. And all of this is indeed working in our direction. This rain will continue to spread in from the west as the evening hours unfold. This is just one of a couple of impact weather makers that will be moving through and visiting our area the next couple, three days. Uh, and this rain will be around tonight through the first part of tomorrow. So let's talk about that on your future cast. Here it comes, spreading in from the west. Everybody will check in with high rain chances overnight through early, early tomorrow. Seven o'clock tomorrow morning, notice the speckles of green and then becoming a little bit more concentrated the farther south you go. Still chances for patchy light rain and drizzle for your morning commute, so allow extra time to get to your destinations. Then we'll trend drier through the afternoon. We'll hold on to lots of clouds. Don't expect a lot of sunshine tomorrow afternoon, but uh, we will trend drier, and those temperatures as a result will climb back into the 50s. So how much rainfall tonight, early tomorrow? This is not a big deal. Uh, this is just enough to cause some headaches out there on the roadways if you have to travel in this stuff. Most areas, less than a half inch of rainfall tonight through tomorrow morning, even here in town, less than a quarter of an inch, so not much at all. It's later in the week when that rain could turn heavy. Now, tomorrow temp tomorrow's temperatures will climb into the mid and upper 50s for the afternoon. Enjoy that and even enjoy Thursday more so because we're going to zoom into the 70s as we move through Thursday. Dry skies expected. Then it all ends, and here's why. We talked about this last night. A front is going to move back south. Low pressure will travel along that front, and the rain showers will become quite numerous, and some of this rain could be very heavy late Thursday night from time to time Friday, even into uh, Friday night as well. Watch this now. By the time everything is all said and done across our area and points north, several inches of rain will be possible with that secondary system late in the week. So here's the forecast in detail. Scattered showers developing will drop into the 40s. Detailed forecast tomorrow, still holding on to a few showers in the morning. We trend drier. Climb into the upper 50s. Vicky, Thursday is still a decent day at 75. And then more rainfall, some of which will likely be heavy, moves in late Thursday night, Friday into Saturday morning. We get rid of that mess. We turn drier. Sunday right now is the pick of the weekend. Oh, good. 66 degrees. That's, that's a nice mm -hmm. day right there with a mix of sun and clouds. So we're going to be down at the Yum Center yes. uh -huh, on Friday. Right. Going to need a well, tent over our head, or you're going to hold the umbrella. Correct. Okay. <laughs> so th <laughs> Thursday will be sure. just fine for okay. us, but Friday, yeah, we're going to be dodging some pretty heavy rain showers, I believe.